back with another one. All right, guys, this is JOATD back with another video. Here in front of you is a 2008 Chevy Silverado. It has a seven and a half inch lift kit on it with a two inch leveling kit. This thing is tucking 26 by 14 inch rims. You can see it. Straight chrome. I want you guys to see like a side view of it so you can actually see the whole truck. All right guys, so today what we did was we installed super tweeters, four super tweeters in this cab. We put one right here on the B pillar on the driver's side, and then we put one on the B pillar on the passenger side. We also put two in the front on the A pillars. We put one right there behind that bolts um, grate, and then right here, we put another one. So I left this one off so that you can actually see how we got it in there. Like, it's just sitting in there. Um, I mean, technically, you see that? Like, it's not going anywhere. You see that? It's, it's, it's a wall behind it, so it won't go anywhere. And what you have to do is this little grate here, I cut the plastic off right here. It had like plastic on it that was kind of out to about right here I cut that off and then all you have to do is just take the grate and just stick it on there and snap it in see that and that tweet is not going anywhere all right and we also have one on the other side over there now basically the ones that are on the side here we just drilled into the panel but we did it in this plate right here that can come out. It just makes it easier to get to the wire, but we drilled through the plate. So this plate has a locator pin behind it. I cut the locator pin off and drilled a hole right where the locator pin goes because the locator pin goes into the metal of the actual B pillar. So basically now this wire goes through here and it goes through the hole where the locator pin went and then we took out this right here. We took out the actual seat belt bolt. That seat belt bolt is a 47, a T47. Okay, let's go back to the back. So you're going to take this out. See, I don't even have it all the way in yet. All right. Now, once you do that, this bottom kick panel right here, you're going to pop this off. Pop this whole thing off, right? It's only two clips it's one here and one here you pull this whole thing out and then this one right here has two clips in it right here you're gonna pop those off and then once you take this off you can pull this all the way out don't take it all the way out you don't have it's, it's two clips up here too but you don't have to take those out to do this job all right once you get everything off and this part kind of protrudes out you're gonna run the wire through here through the back in the metal that's in the back route it all the way down I kind of went beside the seat belt like right here I went beside it and then I went back into the hole and came back down down here at the bottom down here now down here um, the speaker wire from the passenger door rear it goes through here and it's in here and it's down at the bottom inside of here you have a light blue and a dark blue wire. The dark blue is the negative, the light blue is the positive. All I did was connect the speaker wire to those wires, all right? So basically this, the tweeter on this B pillar is connected to this speaker right here, okay? That's basically what I did. And um, these tweeters, the, the wire that's on the tweeter is kind of short, so I had to solder a longer piece of wire on it to run it all the way down here and like I said you're, you're gonna do the exact same thing okay same thing we did on the passenger side now down here at the bottom where the speaker wire comes through at you're gonna have another set of speaker wire you're gonna have yellow and brown the brown is the negative and the yellow is the positive so you're just gonna link it in to that wire I use one of these where you can Put your wire on one side and then put the 
wire from the speaker on the other and then just snap it down. Okay, I use those. So remember, driver side is yellow and brown. Brown is negative, yellow is positive. Passenger side is light blue and dark blue. Dark blue is negative, light blue is positive. Now when you go to the front, and you're gonna put your new tweeters behind here, behind the A-pillar, the red is positive and the red and black is negative. All right, so this tweeter right here, this is the tweeter that came out of the vehicle. As you can see, it's red on one side and then it's red and black on the other side. So red and black is negative, red is positive, okay? And that's what we did. We also put headlights in. We got the all clear headlight in. That wasn't too bad. Got to take the grill off. Got to take this cover off right here for the motor. And you got a 10 mil here, a 10 mil here, and then another screw that goes in the back, back here. If you pull this out, well, as you can see it up in there, right there at the top. We haven't put the screw in yet, but it's a screw that goes in there too. Um, it should be an eight or a 10. It just depends on if somebody took your lights out before, but it's either an eight or a 10 millimeter. But that's how you remove the actual headlight. These down here are the old lights to give you a full frontal. There you go. So you got the clear headlights oh that is gorgeous this vehicle is ready so you can see the whole thing there you go 2008 Chevy Silverado 6 inch lift kit 26 by 14 inch rims. Chrome. Chrome the only way to go, baby. Or black. All right, guys. I'm out of here.